Hello anyone and everyone, I am Echo, and today we're exploring Final Fantasy VII once again. Uh, we are here in the playground, and Eris just ran away because she saw Tifa after we pointed her out. And Tifa looked weird because she was wearing a dress, and she doesn't usually wear a dress, but Eris couldn't possibly have known that. So why did Eris say she looked weird? That kind of doesn't make sense, but whatever. It's okay. It'll work out. Trust me. Or maybe, maybe Tifa was in the back of that carriage because she had been horribly drugged and she looked really aloof. And maybe that's what Eris saw, though she was pretty far away. So I don't know how Eris would have been able to tell if she had been drugged or something. That seems unlikely, but oh well. It's not a big deal. Now we're at South Eris. This place is scary in a lot of ways, especially for a girl, so we've come to find Tifa fast. So we've got to find Tifa fast. I, lo I love how there's just a sign that says South. It doesn't actually say what town you're in, It just or, or, or sector or anything either. It just says South. Oh well. Hey, you two, why don't you get some rest? We have a beautiful room, how about it? Oh, I guess this is an inn or something? Yeah, looks like an inn to me. Any items I can steal? Nope, okay. Does the innkeeper have anything interesting to say, or are you just gonna beg me to pay you 10 gil for... No, no, I will not come again. I have standards. No, I didn't talk to you, jerk. Hey, fat guy, what do you want to say? I just can't make up my mind. Hmm. Huh? About what? Hmm. Don't make me say it. It's the shop down on the right. Hmm? Hmm? Oh, that kind of place. Okay. Let's explore the rest first. Like this box. That you could put your pride in. If you had any. Oh. Hey. Yeah. What the hell is this place? Item. Beep. Blip. Oh! Oh, don't touch that shit. Broken. Okay. Let's, just, I guess, just ignore that for eternity. Sure. Aren't cats great? This one's a little big, huh? Sure. Yep. Okay. Hey, what's this place? It's a tent. Stuff in it. You got a customer. Whoa! Don't just stand there. Say something. But I sort of did. Ish. Echo screen. Phoenix down. I drop hyper tranquilizer. High potion tent. No ethers. I was actually thinking of buying some of those. Since we're running low on, uh, on the magic points. Anything I don't want to sell. No. Why can't we sell this? Uh, I guess he's just a regular item shop. It wouldn't make sense to sell weapons to him. Oh well. And of course, as usual, nothing we can steal. I don't think you can actually take things... At, like, I don't think uh, you can examine the background and get stuff in this game very much. Well, actually, there was the, there was the one kid. We had the option of stealing his last five gil from him by opening his drawer, and that was just a, a background object. So, yeah. Please come in. There's a free pharmacy coupon if you enter now. I don't know what a pharmacy coupon is, but I like the sound of free. Welcome. Sit wherever you like. There's not many options. Have a seat over here. Sit down. Sure. Yes, what will you have? Hmm. Korean barbecue plate. Sushi plate. Today's special. One today's special, coming up. In this store, you pay first. It'll be 70 gil. Oh boy, what is... This? I would've liked to know the price before I, uh, you know, had to get it and pay for it. Thank you, just a second. This better be the best damn daily special you've ever served for 70 gil. That's an outrageous price. There you go, enjoy. 
No comment. It was alright. I've had better dog food. It was alright. Thank you. Here's an item coupon for the pharmacy. You can exchange it for one item there. That's our last coupon for now. Watch out for our next promotion. Received key item. Pharmacy coupon. Okay. Coolio. So let's, uh, let's examine that. Can be exchanged for goods at the pharmacy. Well, yeah, but where's the pharmacy? Is that the room with the Gatling gun in it? I don't suppose it is. Bleep, bip, yep, no. Almost getting shot. Better not touch that computer terminal or we'll literally shoot you. This place is harsh. There isn't even a sign that says don't touch the terminal. It's literally just, if you touch this terminal, we'll kill your ass. That's what you deserve, plebe. I guess. That's what the game says. Hey boy, you sure got a good looking heifer there. Heifer. Take her to the Don's place and you'll make a mint. Wow, yeah, just sell this girl into sexual slavery. Is that what you're telling me? Oh, what should I do? Should I just buy it? What, you looking at a coat rack? It's not even a ten- steal one. Everybody else in this town clearly doesn't give a shit. Just steal one. Nobody's watching it. The rack of coats is just sitting out in the open. Take one and walk away. What's stopping you? Nothing, that's right. Alright, what's up here? Is this the pharmacy? Uh, no, this does not look like a pharmacy. It looks like a place where they sell clothes. Don't push, hooligan. Welcome, please take your time. Okay. I guess I can't actually buy anything yet, because uh, I'm a hooligan. So that doesn't work. Great. Fantastic. Amazing. Alright. Hey! That's some soup you got there? It's a little early to start eating. Come back in a bit. Okay. Let's see what's up here. Oh, is this the pharmacy? This looks like a pharmacy. We're closed now. Okay. Great. Everybody in this town is so friendly and nice and just great in general. All this trash. Can't we do anything? Can't we do anything with it? All this belongs to the owner of the weapon shop. He keeps picking things up and saving them here. Oh, you mean the owner who has a tank in his shop? But anyway, you look at it, it's just trash. Okay, they're just saying the same thing. And this is... Oh, is this the wrestling tent? Yep, it is. <laughs> oh, we'll be back. Alright, anything else up here? In to the uh, restaurant place, I guess. Okay, hey, people will talk. Man, times are bad. And then? Hmm, oh, really? Okay, so just listening in on a conversation there, I guess. Hey, could you do something for me? Someone's been in there all day and they're not coming out. I can't hold it anymore. In the bathroom? Up here? Hey, someone's in here. Don't look! Uh, they've been in there all day, huh? I don't know. I, I only just got here. I don't know who's lying there. Yes, if you want to order, do it at the counter. Fine. Jesus. No, not you. I'm not trying to talk to you, Mr. About to piss his pants. I'm trying to... I'm trying to order at the counter. This is the counter, isn't it? Do I have to order up here? At this counter? That wouldn't make sense. Can we do karaoke here or something? Dance Dance Revolution? No. Anything on TV? Nothing on TV, apparently. Okay, this whole building is a waste of time. I'm mad now. Can we stop them? No, I can't do nothing about it. Got any medicine on you? I'm too hyper and... Ugh. Oh. Um... Too hyper, huh? I guess, I guess, I guess hyper gives you diarrhea. 
Sounds like a really bad. <laughs> sounds like a shitty status effect. Huh. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. So, uh, how about spiderweb? To slow people down. Of course, uh. Potion. If he's sick, a potion should help. I don't know how to actually give it to you. I don't want to accidentally waste a potion by trying to use one for my inventory. Hmm. Hmm. I probably don't... It, the game would probably give me a prompt to use the correct item if I had it. So I probably don't have it. Alright. Let's see what's up here. Oh, there's a lot of stuff up there. Let's go down here first, then. To machine and gun. Is this the place where they said you have a tank? I want a tank. I'd like to buy a tank, please. I'll take one tank. Thanks. Mithril Rod. Metal Knuckle. Assault Gun. Titan Bangle. Mithril Armlet. God damn it, are you kidding me? I just bought all the Titan Bangles. Screw it, I'm not doing that. I'll get the Mithril Rod, though, so she can do a little bit more damage. Alright. Let's equip that real quick. Guard stick. Wow. Nice descriptive name. Okay, and uh, you want something? I don't want to hear any complaints about how things look. Oh, he's in the tank right now. I thought that was like the floor. I thought there was like a just a bunch of junk on the floor or something that he was standing on, but no, that's the tank. Cool, okay. Let's uh, sell to you. Still can't sell the Gatling gun. That's weird. We can sell the guard stick, so we're gonna do that, because we don't need it anymore. We have an objectively better weapon. But it's really weird that we can't sell the Gatling gun. Um, I know it says it's initial equip, meaning it's his starting weapon, and I guess maybe as like a fail safe, they make it so you can't sell the starting weapons so that you always have a weapon no matter what. But they let us sell the guard stick. That she was using. Maybe because Barrett's not in our party right now, we can't sell one of his weapons? I don't know. Um, he, uh, he, he doesn't have any... No, he doesn't have any materia. Okay. Alright, whatever. Whatever. Again, everyone in this town really just outdoing themselves with the hospitality. And up here is just another section of town, apparently. Wow, this is a, this is a big place. Also, I like the uh, I like the like Chinese style buildings. They become, for some reason, they become more common the further north you go. This is Don Corneo's mansion. He's a big shot here in Wall Market. Listen, the Don doesn't like men, so get the hell out of here. Okay. Sure. But, uh, yeah, like, all of these buildings have the sort of, like, slanty roofs of this, like, this thing here with the big gong or whatever under it. They all have the same, like, sort of style roofs and everything. And, like, as you go out here, several of these buildings have it, too, and further south you go, like, the less common they become, I guess. It's pretty cool. Down here, it's just, like, tents and stuff. Yeah. Tents and stuff. Alright, so, uh, so I think we actually need to go this way to continue the story or something. Johnny, man, should I go or not? I got so mental at times like this, I'm hopeless. Hey, aren't you... What? You mean you're two? Don't bring me down to your level. What? Me too. I decided this after a lot of deep thought. My last memories of Midgar, you know? But that guy over there kind of scares me. Okay. Ugh, no way. I can't go in. Things aren't working out. Between our differences and my pay, this just isn't cutting it. Can't even get past you. Jesus. There. Hey. What the hell? You shit. This ain't no freaking show. I'm busy right now. I'm feeling like there's gonna be a fight. Okay. Whatever. Hey, welcome. Even unpopular dreams like you may meet their destiny here. You looking for a girlfriend, too? You know a girl named Tifa? This place doesn't interest me. You know a girl named Tifa? Hey, you're pretty fast. 
Tifa's our newest girl. But unfortunately, she's having an interview right now. Here at the Honey Bee Inn, it's customary for all the new girls to be taken to Don Corneo's mansion. Don Corneo's a famous dilettante. Now he wants to settle down and is in the market for a bride. Okay. The Honey Bee Inn is a private club. Only members can go in. Shoo, shoo. Yes. So, apparently Midgar just literally, like, selling people into, you know, forced marriage is pretty cool, I guess. At least Sector 6. I suppose Sector 6 is, like, the trashy part of Midgar. Yeah. Um, so is this the pharmacy? Because of... No, that's the inn. That's right. That's the inn. So, where's the pharmacy, then? I don't know. Huh. Huh, huh, huh. Oh. Please stop by. What's... Hmm. Have I even been in here? No, that's the... That's the restaurant. So maybe... Is this the pharmacy? Because I, I, I thought this one was the restaurant. I forgot. Just the placement of them. Maybe. I'm not sure. Whoa! Don't just stand there. Say something. Oh, you have a coupon? Then please select any one medicine you like. Sure. Disinfectant. Deodorant. Digestive. Digestive sounds right. Here you are. Received key item. Digestive. So, key item. Digestive. A, di a digestive. Wow. Di descriptive. Such an amazingly written game. Just so oh, the best. The best clues and all the shit and stuff. Yeah. It's amazing. Alright, where the where's the No, not there. Was it this place? Or was it the other one down? I think it was this one. Yep, it's this one. So if we give him the digestive. Hey, someone's in here, don't look. What? Ugh. Give him medicine! <coughs> huh? You'll really give me some? Thanks! Phew, I feel better now. This is for your kindness. Receive key item, sexy cologne. Cool. Cool. The the guy who just went in the bathroom, is he gonna give us something too? Or I mean he should, really. We did that for him. A perfume that amorously arouses. Okay. Never heard of the word amorously before. Whoops! <laughs> okay, whatever. Um, we still can't order anything from that person, even though they told us to order at the counter, the lying bastard. Alright. Um, machine and gun. Where's the wrestling place? It's right here. Let's go to the wrestling place next, I suppose. Let's talk to people. Alright, one, two, three. Squats are all in the rhythm. I'm doing my best, bro. How's this? Okay. Oh dear, I've gained weight again. Join the club. Try it with us. Okay, I don't think we can actually do anything here yet. Never mind. Cool. Alright, so we don't even have to go there. I thought we needed to go there. But I guess not. Alright, let's go back up to Don, talk to the guy. Maybe now that we've visited the Honey Bee Inn, we know Tifa's here, so... Yeah, okay, so now Eris comes out and it'll actually uh, complete the thing. Hey, you got a cute one with you. Hey, this looks like the Don's mansion. I'll go take a look. I'll tell Tifa about you. No, you can't! Why? Do you know what kind of place this is? Then what am I supposed to do? You want to go in with me? Well, being a man, that'll be pretty hard. Besides, if I bust in there, it'll cause too much commotion. But I just can't let you go in alone. Oh, man. First, we need to find out if Tifa's alright. What's so funny, Eris? Cloud, why don't you dress up like a girl? It's the only way! If you sat down for like 10 minutes, you could probably think of several other ways. But... This one sounds pretty nice. What?! Just wait, I've got a cute friend I want to bring. Eris, I can't! You are worried about Tifa, aren't you? Then come on, hurry! Ugh. 
Okay, so we got the perfume already, kinda by accident. Uh, I believe we also need like a wig and a dress. All this trash, can't we do anything with it? Nope, oh, they're just saying the same thing again. They say it belongs to the guy who owns the weapon shop. Whoops, that's not the weapon shop at all. Weapon shop's up here. Can we actually do anything with the weapon shop to like get them to pick up the trash? And I don't remember how to get all the pieces to the costume. Obviously, none of this is what we're looking for at all. Alrighty. Let's go back down. Take a look around. Around town. Uh, what's this place? I can't remember. I can't remember any of this stuff. And he's still gonna say he's not open, isn't he? Hey man, got a minute? I need to talk. Man to man. What is it? Really, I really appreciate it. I'm sorry, but young lady, would you turn the other way for a second? Why? Eris. Gosh! I'm sorry, lady. Now here's the thing. Do you know that vending machine in the inn? I'm itching to know what they're selling in it. I just can't ask a girl to go get it. I just can't ask a girl to go get it. What? What? Why don't I buy it myself? Well, to tell you the truth, I got in a fight with the guy at the inn and can't go there anymore. Come on, so how about it? I'll go. Good, thanks. I'll be waiting here when you're done. Finished. Okay, so... He just needs me to pick up something from the vending machine. Hey, you got homeless man. It's a little early to start eating. Okay. Fine, we won't start eating yet. Let's go to the inn. Apparently there's a vending machine in there that I didn't even notice. This thing right here? It looks sort of like a vending machine, but I guess it's not. What about you? Welcome, it'll be time to go. No, I still don't want to do that. He said it was in the inn, didn't he? This is the only thing here that even remotely looks like a... Like a vending machine. Did he say it was next to the inn? Because then he could mean this, the item thing. Well, let me go ask him again. Because this is a little annoying. How was it? Not yet. Hmm, I'm counting on you. Okay, great. Just great. Fantastic. Of course, you couldn't be helpful. That would be too complicated. And, I mean, the thing's still gonna try to shoot us. Yeah, so that isn't gonna help. Nothing else we can examine in here. Alright. You have anything else to say? Our cat's great. This one's a little big, huh? Mm -hmm. That's just the pharmacy. Let's, uh... Let's go check out the prostitution ring, I suppose. Is it still closed? The honey bee a private club. Only members can go in. Shoo, shoo. Okay. Great. So, I guess nothing to do here. And... Alright. I need to remember which buildings we've actually been in enough times to check. That's the food place. This is... Oh, the clothing shop. Right. We can get the dress here, I'm sure. Don't push, hooligan. Eris, excuse me, I'd like to get a dress. Um, it might take a little time. Will that be alright? What's the problem? Well, my father, the owner, has been in a slump lately. You see, he makes all the dresses. And where's your father? He's probably plastered at the bar. So, you're saying we can't get a dress unless we do something about your father? Yes, I'm sorry. He's caused so much trouble. You'd help me bring him back? Well, if we don't do something, we don't get a dress, right? Really? Please, help my crazy old dad. I just don't know what to do anymore. Alright, we'll do something. Let's go, Cloud. Oh, boy. Okay. So then, up to the bar. Right here. And I'm guessing that's the guy? Excuse us, are you the father of the girl at the clothing store? I own the clothes shop, but I ain't your father. 
I didn't say that. Make me some clothes. I don't make men's clothes and I don't feel like making anything right now. Cloud, you wait over there for a second. I'll try and talk to him. Why don't you go over there and have something to drink? You know, mister, he always said that just once he'd like to dress up like a girl. <laughs> so that's why I wanted a cute dress for him. What? A tough looking guy like that? So, how about it? Will you make him one? Might be interesting. I was getting a little bored just making regular clothes. Then you'll do it for us? Yeah, alright. What kind of dress you want? Something that feels clean, that feels soft. Feels soft, let's just go all the way. All the way, baby. And something shiny that shimmers. Ooh, that's like the same shit. Shiny and shimmering are like the same stuff, practically, I think. Uh, whatever. Shimmers, hmm, got it. You know, I got a friend that has the same taste as him. I'll go talk to him. Okay, apparently the town's also filled with uh, cross-dressers. That's cool. No hate. Cross-dressing's fine. Just kind of funny. A clown filled with enough assholes to have a legal forced prostitution ring also just happens to have like lots of cross-dressers. It seems like a weird combination. I don't know. Doesn't seem like the two would mix all that well. Oh well. Anyway. While he makes that dress, I need to find a way to get a wig, and I, it probably has something to do with the wrestling place, I'll bet. Probably does. I don't know. But uh, we'll find that out next time, because I'm all out of time for this episode, so unfortunately I'm going to have to end it here. But I hope you all have enjoyed it, and I will see you all later. Bye bye <laughs>